Hello friends! I am Diego Melo from Brazil. I created a free panel or dashboard for F1 plan on. Uh, I thank you all for the compliments and for appreciate my work. Now I'm going to show you how to install and configure and some available functions. Let's go! I am still an English student and I am a little embarrassed to speak the language. But okay, let's go. Uh, first step is to get the app from the Play Store. Uh, install in your cell phone. Uh, please don't forget to give me a good review to help me, okay? Remember that your cell phone and the game must be connected to the same holder. After that, enter my IP to find out which IP of your cell phone. Okay, people. Uh, first, sorry my game is in Portuguese, but the screen is similar. See, open game settings, locate the telemetry menu, no, in the field indicate to put the IP, put the number that is on the cell phone. Remember, if your network has DGCP, your IP number can change during the days. Then you need to update in game. Okay? Don't forget this. In the UDP send rate. I recommend you leave it at 20. A larger number can make your network congested. Okay? Now, just enjoy the game information. You can find the manual for each function translated into several languages on our website. I will take above the main ones here. Okay? Let's go. Uh, first, when you make and break or differential adjustment, a red light screen will appear on the left, okay? On the left, you have the information about the car's damage, tire wear, and temperature. Below, you have the user tire and how many laps it made. A small blue or yellow flag indicator. Important. At times, your network may experience oscillations and the dashboard will stop saving information. If that happens, press reset to reset the UDP buffer, okay? Here, you have a weather forecast. Indicate what kind of the weather and the chance of rain at that moment. Then, which forecast will change in 5 or 10 minutes? In the center, you have the main indicators right in your ears. Lap, position, pit window, full, and ERS, total, and lap utilization. On the side, you have the current time, your last lap, your best lap, and the best lap of the session. This is my favorite function. Here, you always have graph and time comparison with the previous lap. If you are fine, the time is negative and turns green. If not, the time is positive and it turns red. This is when the session ends. So, here you can save your story. Until I finish this update, just click to next session. This screen will change in the next update. Instead of five cars, we will only see two with bigger data and more information. But now you can see 
the opponent's team and if he has the telemetry information available in the UDP icon, if it's green, you can see the death of the opponent's car, which are damage, tire wearing, and penalties, in addition to the gap time. Oh, I was just forgot. Here you have the information about how many wearings you took. For every three cut corners, you get three seconds of penalty which is show bellow. Well, guys, that's all. Uh, sorry for my bad English. Please stay tuned for updates the app. We will be releasing new features soon. Thanks for all support. You can see many other tips above the game with subtitles for your language. But in case you don't think my English is so bad, leave your comment. So. I can make new videos in English. Thanks. Don't forget to like and share. Bye.